What's going on? Where are we? We're in Manhattan. We just ate here. We went to the Amsterdam Ale House. Had some good food. Now we're gonna go see a concert. How pretty is this? So pretty. Oh. <laughs> this is a very pretty theater. Have you been here before? Hmm. I like it though. Look at, oh, look at that, man. Yeah, sorry we couldn't get better seats. <laughs> it just looks so pretty in here. I mean, look at that. It's a huge theater. Look at the statues all over the place.
saw the show and we have to get a picture or something with the sign in the background. There we go. See, so there's a sign in the background to prove that we were inside the concert. Uh -huh. Even though it doesn't really prove that we were inside the concert. That's okay. But we were there. We're outside the Bacon Theater. Bacon. Okay. Actually, the Bacon, Bacon Theater. They ruined a great opportunity for calling it the Bacon Theater. Did you like the show? Yes, I did. It was entertaining as Yeah. Oh, seriously. Seriously. It's nice to see your fellow Islander do good. Do very good. Very nice. Staten Island rules, man. <laughs> sure, that too. <laughs> Welcome aboard the Staten Island Ferry. Now, in just a few minutes, this is going to be the best view ever. Actually, just a couple seconds. <laughs> May I have your attention, please? Welcome aboard the Staten Island Ferry. Please take a moment and pay attention to the following That's safety announcements. That's why it's so loud. There's the battery. Battery Park City. And across the way is Jersey City. And there's a little green lady over there. I don't know if you can see her. She's really small here. And there's this lady here. She's missing a torch though. <laughs> across we got a bunch of bridges. The closest one to us is the Brooklyn Bridge. Oh, that is the borough of Brooklyn. Still, will probably be my favorite view ever. And right there is the uh, World Trade Center. World Trade Center 1. Little blinky thing. Well, they don't call it the Freedom Tower anymore. They actually changed the name to One World Trade Center. Why? Did you know that? I didn't know that. Yeah, they, they... I still call it the Freedom Tower. I'm probably going to still call it the Freedom Tower. And I bet a lot of people are still going to call it the Freedom Tower. I haven't been up there yet. Maybe we should go up there someday. Really, that's not a postcard. That's that's something I'm shooting. That's it. That's that's Manhattan. That's the Manhattan skyline. It really doesn't get much better than that. They, uh, there's a few different ferries they have. I remember when I commuted a lot back and forth from from Manhattan. Um, one of the ferries had a, a chair here, like you know, a bench you can sit on, and I would sit out there. It didn't matter if it was cold or whatever. I'd always like to sit out and watch the skyline and then all of a sudden um, some guy stuck his head out like, and ran back in. A few seconds later about 20 people came out and went oh, and just started applauding and it was then I realized I live in the greatest city in the world. <laughs> that was amazing. That was, a, that was a great commute home I tell you. <laughs> Another good reason to live on Staten Island because you get to see the ferry. You get to be on the ferry. You get to see this every day to commute. Although it is a long commute, and maybe this is old to some people, but this never ever got old to me seeing this every day. What is your ferry story? <laughs> it's not really a ferry story. So I was in Manhattan, just in one of the buildings that has a perfect view of the Statue of Liberty. And one of the women that knew me had to grab me and go, Oh my god, you have to see this view. <laughs> and she pulls me over to 
to the window and I look out and I see the Statue of Liberty. I'm like, oh, that's nice. She's like, what do you mean that's nice? We don't get to see this all the time. And I looked at her and I was like, um, I just took the ferry here and I have like this perfect view right there. You see it every day, man. And I saw it every single time I go to Manhattan. She's like, oh, you stand out people. You don't, you don't even know what it's like to see it from this area. And I was like, um, um, the only way you can get closer to this is if you actually take the boat to the Statue of Liberty. Oh, we should do that. It's and a lot one, of fun. And one day we will do that. Younger. There she is. Well, you know she's actually a lighthouse, right? She is a lighthouse. She's probably the most famous lighthouse yes. in the world. She's like, beware, New Jersey's here. Be careful. <laughs> there was a big dispute on whether the Statue of Liberty was in New York or New Jersey. That's true. Um, New but, York won. Well, yeah. <laughs> Statue of Liberty is actually closer to New Jersey, but it's actually on in the state lines of New York, but Ellis Island, that's actually New Jersey, or part of it is New Jersey. There's supposed to be a super moon tonight, but we're not gonna be able to see it. This is way better than a super moon. Hey, did you find it? What's so super about it? <laughs> Looks like a regular moon. It's really bright. Uh-huh. brighter than normal. That's a very bright moon. I think they called it a super moon because when it was rising, it was the closest that it's been to Earth in I don't know how many years. A million zillion years. Not a million. It was a lot less than that. Yeah. But it's a while. And it's not going to happen until 2030 something. That's all right. It's pretty. I'm busy that year anyway, so. 